so good morning it is 9 57 in the a.m and i look like i just woke up but i didn't i promise but um there's a lot that has been happening and i am just now getting to a point to where i can be stagnant enough to come to you guys and give you a bit of update what's been going on first off it very much still looks like christmas i have no intentions on taking down the tree or any of that stuff but there has been a lot going on we have been extremely busy we've been going to weddings i had a baby shower um, we've been out of town a couple of times we've been to family events i had doctor's appointments and now it is what is it january 7th i believe and i am just mm. so a bit of update i am actually home clearly at home what i mean is i am officially off of work so we have taken nala out of daycare and it's been about a week and it's been about about a week roughly um since i've been home so um there's been a lot of transitions with that because now she's on a weird sleeping schedule nala's in the room right now in a swing i'm trying to still recuperate from the christmas and baby shower and all that as far as cleaning up and getting organized my house is still a mess but um yeah i am home i am grateful but i am also extremely exhausted because nala has been getting up at around 11 between 1 and 2 and like 4 and now she's in this transition where she doesn't want to necessarily sleep in her crib and we're in the room with her but she just doesn't want to be in her crib right now she wants to sleep next to us and i'm just fighting with her to sleep in her crib so i bought her a mattress topper and that helps but she's clingy also she is very constipated she has been sick so i've been giving her like plenty of apple juice uh pedialyte that type of thing also i am 31 weeks and three days pregnant <sighs> where has the time has gone like oh so much so much also we have picked baby girl's name baby girl in my stomach um we do plan on doing a name reveal video so i'm just trying to give you a quick summary of everything so those videos will be coming i can't necessarily tell you when because now i'm in a transition so bear with me i do believe that once everything gets together that there will be a lot more videos coming out but i'm trying to find a rotation put um in a pattern so now is roughly her nap time she usually nap around like eight something but she did sleep later until almost seven so i think she's sleepy now let's go check on her Yeah, she is trying to take a nap. She is really sleepy, but she's also fighting it. So, yeah. So, the plan today is, you can see the room is a hot mess. I'm actually in the midst of trying to organize her clothes in new baby's clothes. I have bought so much stuff from Black Friday to this Once Upon a Child sales and stuff like that. So she has so much clothes, well they have so much clothes to wear. I almost got a pre-built outfit in order to basically make sure that they're wearing everything one and two just to be able to put it up because I noticed that when I was doing what I used to do and that was just put pants in one drawer, onesies in one drawer, sleep in one drawer. What ended up happening was because they have, well, because she has Nala, has so many clothes, um, we was missing a lot of pants that she could fit and blah, blah, blah. So I'm gonna just pre-make outfits and then fold them up and put them in the cubby hole. So that's the plan today. Also start editing the video 
while she's taking all her naps today and um, probably go to the store. I want to get some Dawn Dish Soap because I need better bottle cleaner. If you don't have a baby or you're pregnant about to have a baby, um, sound like she dropped her bottle. Hold on. She actually did drop her bottle, but I don't want to give it to her because she doesn't seem to bother into I don't want her seeing me or wake, or wake her up more so I'm gonna wait a couple of minutes but yeah um, something that you should know is that cleaning out either breast milk or formula is a headache uh, formula is worse because um, they can really kill nipples and things like that but get a really good dish soap I really prefer the Dawn Platinum Dish Soap. I feel like those clean the bottles the best. So that's what I want to get today. I'll get in cheap dish soap and you can still see like that residue. Let me tell you. Residue, I mean dish soap and a bottle cleaner is important. I suggest a bottle brush. And don't get the one with the circle like this. Hold on. Don't get only this one. I would say only get this one for the little nipple cleaner only get it for that but not necessarily clean a bottle this brush is the best bottle brush in my opinion to clean out bottles you can really scrub up the sides and stuff like that this one is really hard to really get in the bottle so scrubbing I like this bottle brush better I have seen this plenty of times I got mine off Amazon but I have seen it plenty, plenty of times I like Burlington um, it might have at TG Maxx too, I'm not really sure, but yeah, this is like $5 or $3.99 or something like that, so I would suggest this one over this one, but still get this one, unless you can find this nipple cleaner some other way, so yeah, that's the plan, and we'll see what the rest of the day brings. Is that baby awake? I need to find a small version of this because she loves this type of blanket. But y'all see this uh, swing that I found at consignment? I absolutely love it. I posted it on uh, Instagram and I swear everybody wants to know where I got it from. But it's discontinued. I'm so sorry about it. But she mad I already moved it. Look at the LED lights and the whole nine. You ready to get out, baby? Let's turn that off. You ready to get out? Let that baby go. Let's get that baby out and get that baby. You need to be changed. Yep, you need to be changed because that baby been asleep for like an hour. You need to get out of the sleeper too. Let's get that baby out. Let's get that baby out. What are you going to wear? I probably just need to wear a onesie. Let's put you. Let's just do this one. Let's do this. Oh no. Look at this. Yeah, there we go. So glad that she finally knows how to hold a bottle. Child, y'all know that was a transition. You don't understand. Why is this leaking? Is this leaking? I don't know. Anyway, so I'm probably gonna set her down here, let her crawl around here until she's used to being waking up and try to organize some of these clothes. Like I said, let her drink her bottle and then take it to the living room. Hopefully, we can edit some more. But I'm probably gonna call David and see how he's doing. Yeah, 
Say hi. What's up, y'all? Chilling <laughs> at work, you know. <laughs> Doing my check-ins now, creating a routine, child. So mm -hmm. I'm gonna talk to my husband, child, and my baby, and I'll be back. So I'm back. Nala is right there in that playpen. We are in the living room. By the way, I really love this playpen. Look at you. Look at you. Let me get you your milk. Hold on. Who are you talking to? You want this? You want this? I'm gonna feed her some baby food because it's about that time. Also, y'all didn't see me make this change. Sorry, the TV loud, but oh well. But I actually made this her little like food pantry type area. So I need to probably reorganize this because it's getting low. Not low, but I had bought a lot more baby food the other day. Um, so I try to stock up once a month for this moment when I knew that I was going to be home because daycare feed her for free. But now she's not in daycare, I got to feed her. So I knew this was going to be getting low or lower than it was because I couldn't even put nothing in here. But now it's about that time. So I need to feed her. So what do I want to feed her? Mm. This spice sounds good. Apple, raspberries, and avocado. Let's try that. I really want to put some oatmeal in here because I really want to get her used to eating solid. So let's put some, put this in a bowl and then put some oatmeal in it. half in there right now. It's already kind of complete. A little bit of oatmeal. Stir it up. Let's see how that goes. What's wrong, baby? She has a, she has, she has a habit of crying for no reason. So that's the reason why I'm not Child made her with her. Mm-mm. Don't put your finger in it. <laughs> you don't have to do that. <laughs> mm. There we go. <laughs> yeah. That's you. You about to be 11 months? She's not 11 months for another like two weeks, but. Mm -hmm. Say hey, baby. Look at you trying to stand and stuff. All right, so let me finish feeding her. And I'll come back to you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm.